testimony. Anyone here who has something to say, in the glory of God, of what the good Lord has done for him or her, will you step forward and give your testimony? Hallelujah! Hallelujah! You know, I'm a young woman growing in years, and any time a man comes my way, within a short time, he leaves without any explanation. And today I am free. And I know I am free forever. Hallelujah! Three days ago, a man I really loved, a man I really loved, who left me, came back, begging me that he wants to marry me. He wants to marry me as soon as possible. So I'm happy I don't know if you want to do it. Mama Lucy, how do you find today's service? Splendid, won't you say? Ah, it was superb. God moved in his own way. It was marvelous. I'm so fascinated. I'm so proud with the way God is using Pastor Roland. Indeed, God is using him mightily. And I hear his miracle service is competing with the Sunday church service. Of course. Of course. Uh, and you know, people are easily drawn to miraculous work.
apologize for your message. Oh, don't it mention it. Oh, <laughs> it's not by my mind, by the spirit of God. Huh? Okay. <laughs> so we we'll meet Wednesday. Hello. Midweek. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> okay, then. Take care. Okay, All thank right. you. Yeah. Hi. Hello, Hello, Pastor. Hello, how are you doing? I am fine. I. <laughs> it's a great privilege to meet you. It's fine. Uh, um, I have heard so much about you, and today I, I thought I should say hello to you. Honestly, it's by His grace, not by my power. Okay. Oh, what's your name? I've never met you in church before. Oh, you've been coming here? Um, my name is Georgina, and I just joined the church not long ago. That's great. That's wonderful. So, how did you see the church? How did you find it? Oh. The Lord is present here. That's great. <laughs> Actually, I, I have a burning desire to work in the vineyard of the Lord. Oh, that's great of you. Praise the Lord. That's Hallelujah. great of you. This is where you belong. Hallelujah. You see, the Bible says, Seek ye first the kingdom of God and its righteousness, and all other things shall, shall be added, added unto you. Understand? So keep on coming. Okay? All right, Pastor. Pastor, I, I want to serve the Lord with my time and my substance. With everything within me. You have a burning desire. So why don't we start right away tomorrow? You know, I have to go to some, you know, witnessing you know, and some preaching. Okay? Um, it's unfortunate. I have some appointment to meet tomorrow. But when I'm through, I'll look for you. So we can have a soul together. All right. <laughs> All right. God bless you soon, okay? I'm so happy. I'm oh, so happy. Oh, I am blessed. The pastor has touched me. I am so blessed. Oh, God.
I'm very, very tired. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The harvest is rich. The laborers are few. Pray to the Lord that He may send in more laborers to the field. Amen. But Sister Georgina, tell me, where were you worshiping? Um, with the Sister in the Apostle Revelation Church. Okay. Um, okay. But you see, after some time, I realized they were not to new people. You see, the desire to work for God is burning in me. Praise the Lord. By his grace, um, truly the spirit of the Lord is working in our church. It's raining. Really? God is raining. And we just pray that you should worship with us. Yeah. So that we all work for God. This is for you. Oh, oh yes. You oh, take no, 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 no. You're very tired. At least. At least I can share this with you. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for what we are about to receive. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. This thing is very difficult. Oh, Praise the Lord. visit. Deny me this opportunity. 
Oh, come on, Pasta. You've always been fasting anyway. Just break it this once and enjoy something original for my hands, please. Please, Pasta, please. All right, all right. You win, <laughs> okay? Cool. Thank you, Pasta. Um, please, where is your kitchen?
looking in your eyes For the first time I see you smile I can't believe how much I see When you're looking back at me Now I understand what love is Wait, 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 wait. Oh, Master Roland. Listen to me. Baby, please, don't let me do this, okay? I've never done anything like this before. Uh, uh, Master uh, Roland, I can see the man in you. It's coming out. I've never done anything like this before. You mean you're a virgin? Oh. So I am. Come on, let's land together. For the first time, I am looking. work for some time now. I it's know. God's work. I know okay. it's God's work. I know. Fine, for once. What is going to happen if you don't go today? the need of that. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I didn't call them. If you call them now and they tell you it's emergency, it's urgent, say, come. You, you can find any other excuse okay. than leaving me here. Sorry. 
early this morning I developed some feverishness and some pains and some headache. So I'm sorry, I, I, I can't make it today. I'm, I'm very sorry. Okay? I'm so weak. She's, uh, she's, uh, pasta. Roland. Reverend. Tell me. Tell me what is wrong with you? What is going on? Oh. Nowadays, you are always late. And sometimes you don't even attend church functions. Why? Are you losing interest in God's work? Oh, not at all, Reverend. Not at all. I'm even surprised you, you, you're saying all this. You see, the desire to do God's work is burning inside of me. And I've just realized that I'm carrying so much burden of late. And I just want to offload some. That's, that's exactly what I'm doing right now. Really? Yes, Reverend. Roland, you seen this? You've always wanted more and more responsibilities? Roland, I'm sure you are very familiar with this word in the Holy Scriptures. There is a way that seems right unto man, but the end thereof is judgment. Son, I just want you to be very, very careful. That's all, son.
living God. Yes, yes. 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 you are right. Brother, come forward. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. Let's pray for our brother. Because he's suffering. Deep down here, he is suffering. Because he's filled with the bad spirits. He's causing problems here and there. Committing crimes all over the place. What he's doing, he doesn't know. He doesn't know what he's doing. Now let's pray for him. Let's pray and strike the spirit in him out in the name of Jesus. send them yes. to come and distract yes. or spoil whatever we're doing. Yes. He doesn't have any power over us. Yes. He's been conquered yes. in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Father, we give all the praise, we give you all the adoration. We thank you once again for bringing this prayer session to a successful end. Father, we pray that you revive our spirit Jesus. so that the next time we might withstand yes. any forces that come our way. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. You can all go home. Okay. Take care. Um, let, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll meet on, uh, on Friday, okay? Okay. The same time. Good night, Pastor. Good night, Pastor. Ah. What is going on? What's happening? What's happening? Unto thee, O Lord, do I lift up my soul. Unto thee, O Lord, do I lift up my soul. Oh my God. I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Let my enemies triumph over me. Oh, to be oh no. Oh, Gina. You're welcome. How you doing? sad and disturbed. What is bothering you? Tell me. I'm here because I just had to see you. 
and here I am. Okay? Gino, what is it? There's something I have to tell you. Come on, tell me. I'm just from the hospital. Hospital? I, I missed my period last month and this month too. I, I went for a test and came out positive. Gina, wait. What do, you, what do you mean? What are you saying? I'm two months pregnant. You what? You what? How? No, come on. No. This, this can't be. This is a big disgrace. A big disaster. Roland, what you are asking me to do is against the principles of this church. Marriage is not only a delicate relationship, but a lifelong one as well. So one has to prepare adequately before taking that step. Reverend, you are right. I understand you. But this is an emergency. Georgina had just got the chance to study abroad. And Reverend, to wait for another six months of counseling? Oh, Reverend, please, I just... No, 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 no. hold on. When you told me about your relationship with that lady, I expressed some misgivings. I really wanted you to go through the six-month counseling to enable the church, and even you, to know her better. What you are telling me now is you are not ready to go through the counseling, Roland. No, not at all, Reverend. 
that's not the case. Reverend, nothing bad will happen between us, okay? Nothing bad will happen. We've studied each other very, very well. Reverend, really? she loves me and I love her. Really? Yes. She's so humble. Please, Reverend, I want to marry this girl. Please. Roland, are you hiding anything from me? Oh, God. Reverend, I can't hide anything from you. I can't do a thing like that. You know me. Just that, you just got the chance to travel abroad. Please, Reverend, I need, I need, I need your help. Well, it's difficult. Very difficult. I'll consult the church council and uh, we will take a decision on it. Try to convince them for them to give me the note. Please, Reverend. Lola, please. I say I will consult the church council. All right. Let's pray. In the mighty name of Jesus. And a happy day is today. Today, my son, my own son, Roland Mesa, is wedding his new wife, Georgina Wood. And by the powers invested in me, I am going to perform the marriage rites. Where is the ring? Georgina Wood, my darling, my diamond, my gold, my everything. As my lovely wedded wife. As my lovely wedded wife. Love and to hold. To love and to hold. From this day onwards. From this day onwards. In sickness and in health. And sickness and in health. For richer, for poorer. For richer and for poorer. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. I, I, Georgina Wood, do take thee, do take thee, Roland. Gold men, sir. <laughs> As my lovely wedded husband. As my lovely wedded husband. To love and to hold. To love and to hold. <laughs> from this day onwards. From this day onwards. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health for richer for poorer for richer and for poorer till death do us part till death do us part and I declare you husband and wife you may now remove the veil
this bit after that. Gina, no food for me. How do you expect me to provide food? When the housekeeping money you give me so little. <sighs> but I just gave you some money not long ago. Prices have gone up. Have you forgotten? <sighs> Gina, I always expect you to manage. The ministry is not a money making venture, okay? Oh, it is. Look at the kind of head pastor he's using. Look at you, walking on your two legs. Let it come quick, else there are going to be many more days without food in this house. Not even some bread so that I can take some tea before I sleep. Hold on, please don't disturb me, okay? Fine, check, 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 check. Please, excuse me. Sister Georgina, I call to caution you. 
See, what you're wearing for change today is a bit inappropriate. Inappropriate? Yes. What? What is inappropriate about what I am wearing? Is it because I'm prettier than you and you're jealous of me? Is this why you called me? God. Sister Georgina, you dare raise your voice at me? Have you forgotten what the Bible says about decent dressing in 2 Timothy 2 verse 9? God did not say we should be old-fashioned. Are we in the backward church or what? Huh? Sister Georgina, you are promoting promiscuity. What example are you setting for the young ones to emulate? You are a pastor's wife. I am setting good examples. Look, God did not say we should be shabby and dull. But there's generous blessings are to make us look sharp and beautiful. And hey, I won't allow you to intimidate me, okay? I'm also a pastor's wife, just as you are. And for your information, this should be the last time you call me for such rubbish, okay? Excuse me. Aspirants, you know, they are fundraising and all those things. I have been praying for some of them. Hey. 